At first glance, this tiny village in western Ukraine looks like it's been long abandoned. The residents are few, the buildings in disrepair. Plus here, near the border with Moldova, looting is a rampant problem. But if you look a bit closer, there's something quite distinctive that stands out in the vast landscape, and that is beautiful artworks. We met Oleksiy Alashkin, the master behind many works in the settlement. Having moved here 36 years ago, he knows every house and even every cellar by the back of his hand. This is all natural rock, but people have built onto this with stones they found. Every person needs to fight for their spirits in their soul. Alexei and his wife have painted eight houses here. Now they have a puppet theatre and a house with paintings, pottery and, of course, musical instruments. This is the music room. You can play any of these instruments, wood, metal or traditional ones. The school in the village of Bukadnitnia once had 400 students, now just 18 study there. One teacher points out where bright paintings of traditional Easter eggs, flowers and feathers used to shine, now just fire extinguishers hang here. But it's not all bad news. The local authorities presented the local artists with a present, an old house near the main road. Oleksiy says red is a very dangerous colour, the colour of blood and love. Who is such colour dangerous for? Anyone who's afraid. It's hoped the homes Alexei painted will become part of history.